Hey YouTube, it's Craig here and I'm back with a new video. This one is going to be all about my weekend at the Los Angeles International Pen Show. And I hate to say it, but I'm not very good at vlogging. And this is more of a day-to-day -day recap of what kind of went on. I meant to film more, but unfortunately I had so much fun that I neglected to film much of anything. So here is my first pen show. All right, this is day one of the Los Angeles International Pen Show. I am currently in my driveway, but I'm all packed up, ready to go. It's just about 11.15 in the morning. I'm gonna go meet up with Greg over at the hotel and the trader tables don't actually open until around two. Just wanna try getting there early and see if anything might be happening. I'm gonna show you guys what I brought in my bag and then we're gonna head on out to Verdana Beach. Give you guys an idea, this is my backpack slash messenger bag. It's a Topo Designs bag, this bright yellow interior. I have my Galen leather 40 pen case, my Frank and Christoph pen roll. I am bringing the uh, Lockbee journal. It's got my proof vaccination card in it just in case that I need that. And then I have some journals and some brand new Rhodia dot pads to bring to test things out. Most of my German pens, if not all my German pens are actually inked up. And then I have one uh, Waterman's Ideal that is inked up as well. This one is inked up and I'm going to be carrying this around with me and writing things with it at the show. I also have a loop with me. I have my tripod with me, but I'm really excited. Let's head out to the show. All right, guys, so we just got done with our first day of the pen show. It was a little small little gathering, not too many people there, but I did purchase one pen. I got a Waterman's number seven with the red nib, so that's pretty cool. Now I'm gonna drive home. And then I'll be back to do this again tomorrow and we'll see how it improves. Sorry, the first portion of this video was a little shorter, but uh, I was having a lot of fun and then hanging out with Greg and watching everything that he purchased. But, but right now it is 11 o'clock. I got here at noon today. Day one complete, three more days to go. All right, see you tomorrow. All right, guys, so it's day two. It's 10.37 in the morning. I'm getting ready to head back to the Torrance Marriott for the second day of the pen show. And my little badge for the Los Angeles International Pen Show. And yeah, that's fun. It's about a 30 mile drive over to the show. So let's, let's do it. Today. 
So I let some of my pens go uh, for cash and picked up these, the red one yesterday, the green one today. Both number sevens. And yeah, uh, it was all my uh, 52 and a half these and just trying to upgrade the collection a little bit. <sighs> All right, guys, you know, after day two, I'm realizing I don't really know how to vlog, but what a fun day. We basically, I just talked from the time I got here, 1130 in the morning or so until eight o'clock at night, finally grabbed food. And then Greg and I went back and we hung up his room and just chit-chatted about all kinds of stuff. And I had a blast. What a, what a good time. I just met a lot of really cool people and I bought... Another pen, I got a Waterman's uh, number seven green. It has a Canada nib on it, but it's still pretty cool. Another awesome day at the pen show. Oh, I, I also bought some uh, books from Scott B. Jones, uh, which I'll go through with you guys. But day two is in the books and day three tomorrow. All right, we're here, let's go do it. Let's go get it done. I feel like I got hit by a truck and it's just the fact that, and I haven't even been drinking. It's just, it's a lot of uh, talking and uh, not a lot of walking to be honest, uh, but I've been having a blast. So let's go check out the show and we'll see how busy today is. So far, Thursday was pretty slow. Yesterday was picking up a little bit, but it's Saturday. So let's go have fun with it. We're back at Mad Mercantile and I ran into David and I gave him a notebook and <laughs> it's going good. I gotta stay away from this place. So I just had a blast all day. You can see here it's nighttime, but it's 7.30 at night and I started off the day with one of these pens is, in, is new, so it's this one. It's a 52V, and it has this silver clip that was made by Andy Bellevue. He worked on the LEC that I sold. This is a 58 that is going to be available from Greg the Antique Digger. I'm just I, I'm going to do a little writing sample with it before I send it into him. But nothing else has changed. I I mean, these are all different, but I had so much fun hanging out with David Garcia that I kind of forgot to film anything. But not a lot happened today. Um, tomorrow is the big actual pen show day. So it was a good one. Somebody actually used my coupon code Craig and bought an Amiki. And I'm just so excited about that. I can't believe it. You know, thank you for supporting me, you guys. Day three was, uh, was good. It was a lot of fun, a lot of hanging out, meeting some new faces. So there's the Watermans, Schaefer, the Parker Vax. This is a a single jewel azure this is a double jewel this is a second gen and this is a third gen this is this was my gift from greg for my birthday so i have a vanishing point now my 823 here's all my cavecos and then i have yukari royale the custom uh 845 my lami the dialogue 3 egyptomania Rouge Noir, the 146, the 149, the 800, and the Auto Hut Design 8. Pretty awesome, really awesome day. And it's the end of day three, and I'm back home. I barely filmed anything while I was there. I, I ran into people who have been talking to me from YouTube, and I didn't even get a chance to really film anything. It's time to go to bed. I'm gonna be up at six to get there bright and early before the masses really show up. I'm really excited though. Busiest day, all the vendors are there. Shouldn't be there too long, but we'll, uh, yeah, time to go to bed. All right, it's 8 a.m. It's the last day of the pen show. It's the busiest day. Going from Thursday where there was nobody there to Friday where there was not really anybody there to yesterday where there was more people, but 
it still wasn't overwhelming or anything. I, from what I hear today, it's going to be absolutely overwhelming. So I have 10 Watermans. I started off this entire trip with 13. I have 10 now. I want to have 12. So it's like the perfect row in my Toyuka Craft case. So the plan is I'm going to get from Mike a Waterman's number seven in purple. It needs work. And then I'm going to go over to Sarge's table and I'm going to get the Waterman's number seven in yellow. That's the plan. See how it pans out. I also need to pick up some things for other friends on Instagram and that sort of thing. Inks. And this is the day where uh, you're going to be able to find all the stuff from the vendors. Just the first two days there were no vendors. And then yesterday there was a couple vendors, but I'm excited. Let's, let's get to it. And, uh, my first pen show will be in the books. And later today, there's an Orange County pen hangout that I'm going to go to. And today is my sister's birthday. So I want to be home and celebrate her birthday with her because that'd be the worst brother ever. Can't do that to her. So, all right, let's get it. Oh, here come all the, here come the hordes of people. Thank you so much. Ignore the flashing lights of this parking structure, but I just got done with the pen show and I came and I conquered and I got the pens that I was set out to get. I also got uh, some ink for one of my friends and seriously, just such an awesome show. I had so much fun. You know, thanks so much to Mike and Scott and Troy and David and I even got to see my friend Ish today and Nick and uh sarge for selling me the, the super rad uh yellow number seven and really just super awesome that sean designed they were really awesome i had a blast i'm super excited i want to go to another one now but i gotta hold off and wait and save money but really really great time what a nice way to end the show we had the oc pen meetup and that was super fun what a great day sad the show's over but you know my wallet is happy that the show's over and uh until next time what a blast and that's the video thanks so much for checking out you guys if you have any questions leave a comment down below if you like the video give it a thumbs up please subscribe for more content like this and you guys thank you so much last week i did hit 1000 subscribers so my 1000 subscriber giveaway is coming soon really just as soon as that pen comes in I will be happy to give it away to one of you along with a $250 GouletPens.com gift card. Thank you so much, you guys. I really, really appreciate all of the support. Check out my Instagram at Craig Rocanova, and we'll see you guys in the next video. All right. Peace.